This is Coogan Cassius for IFL TV in association with Macklin's Jim Arbour. We're at the press conference here for Friday Night Lights, July 24th at Wembley Arena. With me, not fighting Frank Bullioni, but I've got Lee Markham. Um, obviously this was penciled in as the, the rematch between the pair of you, which uh, you're obviously looking forward to, but in all honesty, you can't blame Frank for uh, taking his shot against Speed or Tudor off. No, of course not. Any, any fight I do the same, to jump a chance at a world title, so yeah, can't blame him. We've still got unfinished business, so the fight, no matter what the result is, is going to make sense for that somewhere down the line, so I'm sure the rematch will take place at some point, but also, and that good luck to Frank, I hope he wins, not just so I'll get a crack, but I hope he wins for like, British boxing. When you first heard about it, you must have been a little bit disappointed, I don't know if for Frank, but obviously for your own career, you must have been a little bit disappointed that this rematch isn't happening on that day. Yeah, I was, but they, they, they've looked after me well and still stuck me on the bill, uh, hopefully fighting for Frank's start vacant title, the WBO European, so... Obviously, I'm still, things haven't really changed yet for the rematch. And I, I, I still believe that'll happen someday. So, um, yeah, it's not. It took the sting out of it a little bit. <laughs> I mean, common sense says, I mean, if Frank is victorious on the night against Children of which we hope it is, then uh, your rematch has still got to come at I some see, point I've after had that. A gentleman's agreement that said, um, like, if, if he does win, he'd give me a crack at it. So, you know, if, if he's a man of his word, I uh, can't complain about that. Have you obviously got an opponent um, that's near to being confirmed for that date? I don't know if uh, these guys have got someone in line or someone sorted but I don't, I don't know who I've got at the minute so I'm just training regardless so yeah I don't know who I've got. <laughs> that's alright but I mean listen it's, it's one of them things and I'm sure if you was in the same position I'm sure like I said any boxer wouldn't begrudge someone with a great chance to do that so no, that's right. but as long as you get your rematch uh, I'm sure in due course you'll be happy. That's right yeah and listen Frank's a great guy and he's done well and he, get, he deserves a crack it and good luck to him. I hope, I hope he wins for himself as well. Mm. It's a cracking bill anyway, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, Billy great. Joe Saunders on the bill as well, Mitchell Smith on, yeah. and Oval McKenzie as well. So, so it makes it, makes it uh, selling the tickets a little bit easier than it when you've got a cracking card to be on. So, yeah, no, look forward to it. All right, Lee, listen, thanks for talking to IFL TV and that said, uh, let us know when your opponent is confirmed for that date and yeah, uh, we'll, we'll catch up with you soon ahead of the fight. Yeah, thanks, Gregan. All right. Cheers, mate.